Hello everyone, good morning, or at least it's morning when I'm filming this. I, I don't know when you're watching this. I'm sure there's at least one or two of you who are wondering where I've been, and basically I've just been doing the whole school thing. I've been taking school pretty seriously, and I'm not gonna lie, I think I've been pretty productive here. Not trying to brag, Okay, sl slightly trying to brag. So in today's video, I'm going to take you through a few productive days in college. And the reason why I'm titling it like that is because apparently that does well in the algorithm and gets a lot of views. So hopefully I become famous. So as you can see by my phone, it is 7.42 a.m. I notice that a big factor in my productivity is if I get up early or not. Because if I get up early, I have time to like eat breakfast and like, you know, do some assignments before my class is really started start for the day. Now the main problem is that I have a very inconsistent wake up time. Like the other day I woke up at like 10 and, and today I woke up at like 7. It, it's, it's very inconsistent but I kind of created a somewhat foolproof way to kind of wake up early. So basically what you do, assuming if you have alarms, I would assume all of you do. I take my phone which has my alarm in it. I don't think anyone has alarm clocks these days. If you do, good for you but also why? So basically what I do is I put my phone across the room so when my alarm goes off, I have to get out of bed to get the phone. Now nine times out of ten I'll pick up the phone and then I'll just go back to bed but sometimes I pick up the phone and I'm like you know what I'm up I'm gonna walk around I'm gonna be productive and that's what I chose to do today. So right now I'm gonna get breakfast and luckily for me the only dining hall that serves breakfast is the farthest place away from campus for me so so that's always fun. I read somewhere that breakfast is the most important meal of the day. I don't know if that's true I don't eat it all the time. So as I said the only available dining hall is like the furthest away from where I live so that's always great as you can see in the morning it's not really that crowded here I guess a lot of college students don't like to wake up early now one thing that my school does is that they require that before we enter any building we have to show that we don't have COVID um, and I actually really like that because it makes me feel like a lot safer knowing that everyone there has negative tests So I just got breakfast. It was really good actually. I even got recognized for the first time like this whole semester. So that was pretty cool. I believe his name was Nick. So Nick, if you're watching this, thank you so much for saying hi. I really appreciate it. And if you ever want to hang out, just feel free to contact me. That goes for anyone who goes to my school. Just shoot me a DM or something. My mask keeps falling off my nose. And here we have the shortest crossing light in human history. All right, so now I am headed to the post office because I have a bunch of packages waiting for me. All right, everyone, I am in the elevator. And as you can see, I got a vacuum. All right, so I just got back. As you can see, I got a vacuum and I got a bunch of other random stuff from Amazon as well. But the reason I got a vacuum is because, well, my floor is disgusting and I forgot to bring a vacuum. So that's why I have a vacuum now. Now, when we talk about- I'm not calling. Really? I think I got it. Do you think people will be annoyed if I start vacuuming at 9 a.m.? All right, everybody, so it's currently 10 o'clock, and I have already gotten breakfast, picked up some mail, and cleaned my room. So. I'm being pretty productive today. And eating breakfast is a big deal for me because a lot of the times I only eat dinner, which isn't very healthy. So it's nice to eat breakfast from time to time. So I'm gonna use this time to knock out some of the work I need to do for my internship. Hopefully, if I'm productive enough, I can just get it all done with so I don't have to worry about it anymore. But I'm gonna do some work and be productive. So here we go. So I knew this perfect productive day was too good to be true because the moment I tried to log on to class, my Wi-Fi started acting up and then my computer charger died. Like, it just doesn't work anymore. I tried restarting it several times, tried pretty much everything I could find online, so I'm gonna go to the bookstore to buy a new charger. It's really unfortunate too because in one of my classes we had a deadline assignment where we have to do something by the end of class, but I told my professor and she said it was cool and that she understands, so that that's always good. Good. A few minutes later. All right, so I'm gonna be honest with you. I'm having a 
pretty terrible day as of right about now. So I went to the school bookstore to see if they had chargers because it said they did on their website. Well, they didn't have like the MacBook charger that I needed. Then I went to Target and saw that they were all out of Apple products. They've been out of Apple products for like weeks now. Every time I go there, it's just empty. So I asked them and they're like, yeah, we don't have any. So now I've kind of resorted to the last option, which is go to the Apple store, which I don't really want to do, but I don't really have any choice at this point. So I'm going to take an Uber to the Apple store and pick up the charger and hopefully that fixes my problem. All right, everybody, here's the situation. I'm sorry for the kind of bad lighting, but I'm really sad right now, so I don't really want to adjust this. I missed two classes today because my computer charger just didn't work. Now I suspect the reason why my computer charger didn't work is because the cable is really frayed. Like if you look at the cable, it makes sense as to why it doesn't work anymore. I guess the kind of weird thing is that it's been like this for a very long time and it just finally gave out. I am picking up a new cable in about an hour. I'm probably going to Uber there because I don't know if I really want to take the L during a pandemic. I don't know if I really want to take an Uber during a pandemic either, but I don't really have any other options at this point. Hey everyone, so I just got back from the Apple store and um, the charger works, so that's that's cool. I still got some time left in the day, it's four o'clock. Usually I'm kind of productive towards later in the day, so you know, we'll just take things from there. All right, so now I need to make up that assignment that I couldn't do because my charger wasn't working. It's like four or five hours late, but um, I, I don't really know what else I could have done. All right, so I just finished writing my script for this assignment I need to do, and now I'm going to voice it. I've always been told I have a face for radio, so maybe that's my true calling. Spring break starts for colleges across the country. Public health experts urge people to be cautious if they are traveling. All right, so now that I have this assignment done, I'm gonna go get dinner. I like to get dinner right as it opens to beat like the dinner rush and get a place to sit. I'm sure you saw with the breakfast footage, but normally I'll actually sit down when I'm eating. I feel relatively safe there. I know there's a lot of maskless people when you're eating, but it's relatively spaced out and I try not to stay there longer than I need to be. All right, everyone, so I just had dinner. I had chicken nuggets today. They were pretty good. Now I'm going to go to the IC, which is basically this place where I study. It looks really pretty at night, actually. Look at that. All right, hey everybody, I just got done at the IC over there. You can't see me right now because it's dark outside. As you can see, like this place looks like really beautiful at night. Like I really like, I don't know. I mean, I just think campus looks really cool at night. Let me enjoy some things, you know what I mean? But I actually finished up my work earlier than normal because I'm really ahead on school assignments right now. And the reason I'm so ahead is because I've just had like some time and I've really been productive recently. So like if I have an assignment that I know is due, I just get it done a few days before. I know I'm like one of those lame people who does that, but it's like, I don't know, it's a pretty, it's a pretty efficient strategy. I'll say I'm definitely less stressed than I normally am. Like I'm still stressed out, but I'm, I'm less stressed out. So over here is where I get tested. I get tested here for COVID twice a week. All right, everyone, so I just got back to my place. As you can see, it's kind of messy, but you should have seen it this morning. Like, it was much worse this morning. Like, what you're seeing now is pretty tame, but yeah, although I had a really rough day, I actually got some work done, and I think now I'm gonna relax. I feel like these past couple of weeks, I haven't really been able to give myself a break. Like, I've been studying a lot. I've been, like, working really hard. Ow, my ear. I'm gonna have some Eric time. I don't know what that entails yet, but maybe I'll watch YouTube or something. I don't know. But yeah, I will film some more for you tomorrow, so I will see you then. Oh, hi. 
didn't see you there. I was just making some breakfast. So right now it's 10 a.m. I know it's weird. Yesterday I got up at 7 a.m. and now today I'm getting up at 10 a.m. It, it doesn't really make much sense. Yesterday I got like no sleep but woke up early and today I got a lot of sleep and woke up late. So I'm starting to think more sleep is bad for me. That doesn't make sense. But yeah, since it's 10 o'clock, the dining hall for breakfast is already closed. But luckily, I have a uh, stash of Cliff Bars. I know these are meant for like a heavy workout, but sometimes I'll just eat this for breakfast. But today I don't have any classes, but I do have a group project I need to work on at about 4 o'clock. So I think what I'm going to do now is I'm going to prepare for that group project, eat my breakfast, and do some other work. And then also I have to get a COVID test. All right, so right now I am preparing for my Spanish group project. We're doing it at like four o'clock today. But for those of you who don't know, I am really bad at Spanish. I'm in Spanish one right now, which is like the beginning Spanish, which is funny because I took Spanish for three years in high school, but I forgot all of it. I, I don't think I really ever learned anything, which is actually kind of funny because somehow I was in the Spanish Honor Society in high school, despite knowing hardly any Spanish. All all right, so when I was grabbing this camera, I accidentally took a picture and it came out like this. I know, I, I looked really good in that photo. So I just finished my Spanish work, and here's the thing about productivity. Is it productivity? Is that how you say it? Product, yeah, product, productivity. When it comes to being productive, it's not just about getting my schoolwork done. There's other things that I need to get done. So right now I have some free time before my COVID test. So I'm gonna go down to the laundry room and see if I can uh, do my laundry. All right, so I went to the laundry room and all the machines were available. So I guess 12 o'clock on a Friday is a pretty good time to do your laundry. So right now as I'm waiting for it to get out of the washing machine, I'm doing some work for my internship. I'm basically scheduling videos and writing descriptions, basically stuff I would normally do for my own YouTube channel, except I'm doing it for like an actual company. But I'm gonna keep working on this stuff. And then when my laundry's done with the washing machine, I'm gonna put it in the drying machine. Cause I don't know if you guys have ever done laundry before but you you wash it and then you have to dry the clothes so I think while the clothes are drying I'm gonna get my COVID test all right everyone so my clothes are currently in the dryer I have a COVID appointment that I'm running late for so I'm gonna do the COVID appointment as my clothes are drying so I'm doing like two things at the same time The past couple days it's been like 30 or 40 degrees, which in Chicago in the winter is the equivalent of like 100 degrees in the summer. But I just got my COVID test and now I am going to go back to my room. Hello everybody, so I just got back from my COVID test and I also finished up with my laundry. I think right now the only thing I have left to do for the day is to do that Spanish thing which is in a few hours. And normally I actually have a lot of assignments due on Friday, but what I like to do is the moment I get an assignment, I, I try to do it just to get it out of the way. But since I don't have that much going on for the rest of the day, I think I'm gonna call the video here. I'm sorry if this video was all over the place, but then again, all my videos are all over the place, so this really shouldn't be much of a surprise. Special shout out to members of the Eric Rand Films channel. Thank you so much, Will, Alex, Rocky, and Neem. Thank you so much for the support. If you're interested in becoming a member, click the link down below and learn about it. But if you enjoyed today's video, make sure to leave a like. Also leave a comment. What did you think of the video? What do you think about the stuff that I did? And make sure to subscribe to the channel to help me reach my goal of 5,000 subscribers. Also, leave me some video suggestions because the main reason I haven't been making a lot of videos lately is one, because I've been very overwhelmed and stressed out with tests. But two, sometimes I don't really know what to film. So if you have any suggestions, feel free to leave them down below. And if they don't suck, maybe I'll do them. But thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate it. And I will see you next time. On a grind, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, going strong. Kill it how I do it, TNT, we blowing up. Level up, game never stops. Showing love, telling haters, keep, keep, keep it real, my time is on.